what is up youtubers it's one for five shadow stalker and I'm bringing you a Sony Vegas tutorial this time I'm gonna make you oh my god I'm gonna show you how to make a predator heads up display what that basically means is like well if you ever watch the movie predators you'll see like basically the vision of it the sight it's pretty cool and without further ado let's get started so first just go to project media and import your clip and I'm gonna import mine okay so right here I got like this clip from like a montage thing or whatever you like to call it and I'm just gonna find a cool part like right over there what do you want to do next right here just click S delete with whichever part you want I'm just gonna delete this track because I don't really want it once you're done with that you like find your other one oh, hold on okay we can delete that okay so now you got like this segment and it's like yeah okay so next you go to media fire and there, there's a link on the bottom uh, to download it uh, like the heads up display itself once you're done just open it and I'm having mine in WinRAR already uh, I've already downloaded it and once you open it it should be on WinRAR there's a lot of these things you got predators, snarl, roar, whatever and then you wanna go to avpborder.wmg and make sure that there's it's the one that has like a movie clip to the left of it just click on it and drag it to your Sony Vegas and put it on the bottom of your video clip once you're done with that go to acid lockdown doesn't really uh, matter but just I think go to SFK file and uh, oh, hold on. okay it's not SFK file it's mp4 dot document sorry guys once you're done with that you wanna go to all these all of the video clip for each of them click on compositing mode and click on screen and you go to this one too just basically do it to all your thing and if you look closely you can see that there's this you can see the vision right now okay so now if we, if we were to play it okay so that looks like pretty cool you can mess around with whatever in it now to make it more like realistic I should say like more like how the predator does it is go to chroma key uh, go to color balance sorry and click on red midtone and drag it to your predator files okay and what you want to do is for red just move it up to 5,000 0 0.5 thousand and green and blue just drag it all the way to the left minus 0 0.5 thousand and you can see that it's awesome red now and do the same thing for the auto targeting system whatever you call it just click on red midtone drag it there and hold on okay and if we were to play it you can see that the triangle has changed and yeah and next what you want to do is you can see that the triangle is just going at random places you, you can do that you go to your predator lockdown click on video event pan crop you can right click it zoom out and just go to the clip of when like 
Okay, so you can see that over there, my guys over here. And uh, hold on, put it back. All right, and you can modify it anywhere you want. I can't really show the triangle for some reason, but yeah, whatever. And you'll notice in the first part, it's a bit laggy. But once you rendered it, it's like, yeah, it's pretty smooth. Now you can see that the red predator site, the heads up display is like not full screen. How you do that, if you want to make it full screen, right click on it go to properties and this is for Sony Vegas Pro 10 maybe in 9 and 8 it's pretty different but yeah one go to the video event tab and click on maintain aspect ratio you want to make sure that the maintain aspect ratio is not picked click OK and you can see that the red is like full screen now and if we were to play it, I modified the next, like, I modified this example, did the same thing, but here's the example.